Hi, I'm NASA Kennedy's Nick Amadeo, and I'm taking you inside KSC. After a late night launch from Cape Canaveral Air Force Station on February 9th, Solar Orbiter has officially begun its seven year mission to study the sun. A United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket with the spacecraft aboard blasted off from Space Launch Complex 41 at 11.03 p.m. Solar Orbiter will give an unprecedented look at our star, providing the first images of its poles. Scientists will gain a better understanding of how the sun affects the space environment throughout the solar system. Solar Orbiter is a cooperative mission between the European Space Agency and NASA. The spacecraft was developed by Airbus Defense and Space. NASA Kennedy Space Center Director Bob Cabana shared accomplishments and highlighted future exploration during a recent employee event held at the Florida Spaceport. In 2020, the launch manifest includes 51 launches from the center and Cape Canaveral Air Force Station. Kennedy continues to play a major role in the agency's Artemis program that will land the first woman and the next man on the moon by 2024. Cabana's update immediately followed NASA Administrator Jim Bridenstine's announcement of the President's fiscal year 2021 budget request for the agency. The more than $25 billion requested is an increase of 12% from a year ago. For more inside KSC, check us out on social media and at nasa.gov forward slash Kennedy.